Hi everyone, it's Heather and I'm back with another video. I'm sorry, it's been a little bit. I had to take last week off because I've been so slammed with getting ready for conventions and just like in general trying to meet deadlines and unfortunately something had to get to give really because the amount of stuff that's been going on, I didn't really want to miss another comic. Because I missed one a couple weeks ago and I felt terrible about that. So unfortunately I had to miss a video last week but I'm back with a, a new one. It's kind of a short one. Um, so I decided that I would try something new. I had met a couple kids at the store I work at not long ago and they had given me some ideas for videos and one I really liked which was um, redrawing or attempting to redraw um, a drawing from, I guess, another artist. I could just leave it as another artist. It doesn't necessarily have to be kids or anything, but he just happened to be a kid, and he drew this little alligator, little creature that you see over in the top left corner, and I thought it was super cute, and I attempted <laughs> to redraw it in my own style. I do love drawing, like, small creatures and cute chippy things and, um, just cute animals, stuff like that. So I don't draw reptiles too often in cute chibi form, so this was a little bit tricky for me. The artist's name is Corgi King, which I'll put up on the screen, and he drew this little alligator, little cute alligator you see on the top. And I also used a photo reference, which you see right under it. I just kind of tried to interpret a little baby alligator as best as I could. I'm assuming it's an alligator. It could be a little dinosaur. I'm not sure, but it was cute. And I tried to just draw it in my style. I like the idea of the little pet alligator or something, so I kind of drew him in a dog pose <laughs> so he'd be sitting there, you know, just kind of hanging out. Translate into my style as best as I could. I'm not crazy also about the colors, I tried to keep, um, pretty close to the original like little baby alligator crocodile colors you know as best I could but it kind of came out a little muddled I think um I may at some point like try to come back to this or redo this I'm not sure but um it's not again not my most favorite thing so hopefully Corgi King I hope you like this we appreciate it um, it's just a new kind of thing I decided to do and maybe if you guys want to send more pictures um, I will send my email which is heather at jdcomic.com if you want to email me there um, I can't guarantee if I get like a bunch of them I can't guarantee I could do everyone's but if you'd like to try to throw up like a character design or some kind of like creature design that you've had um, and you'd like me to try to redraw it in your style. Um, I'm open to try to do that for maybe some future videos. Um, can't guarantee, again, can't guarantee that it's gonna happen, but uh, I'd like, you know, I like to see what people have to draw and I love to see like other people's artwork. So either way, it's a pretty good guarantee that I'll actually see it and I'll at least like let you know. The scales were a little bit tricky. I used some kind of like texture brush to kind of make them like a little more like scaly looking. Um, obviously I added them, I drew my own scales on there. And I used a bit of a hard brush just to like go over the highlights just to make them look a little shinier. And here's the scale brush right here. The, so I had some trouble picking one that actually worked out okay. But I think I found one in the end that was 
that did kind of the trick. <laughs> I think he's got a cute face at the very least. Thank you so much to my monthly patrons, Aaron Lindo, Ben Ray Human, Brandon Tinch, Colin Wombrot, Council of Geeks, Dark Leap Master, Hexapus Inc., Jack Mahan Tenney, Jesse Girona, Merrick Bennett, Story Comic, and a very special thank you to my $10 patrons, Corbin Kovalt and Steve Zarsinski. So I know it's a short one, but I hope you guys enjoyed this and I will try to do something a little more involved next week. I will be working on the video for the um, Terrific Con convention that I just came from this past weekend. I'm not feeling like, super great, so that's another reason why this is a short video, but I will try to get something a little more substantial next time and uh, alright, I'll see you all next time. Thanks for watching everyone. Bye!